What's good, everybody? It's Jay Coffee Talk. How's everyone doing? I hope you guys are having a great weekend. Subscribe to the channel and hit that bell. But let's get right into this news here. And it's crazy, man. It feels like 50 Cent and Rick Ross been going at it forever, man. You know, um, th there's a lawsuit going on right now. Um, that's what I'm speaking on here in this video where 50 Cent is, you know, arguing in court. He's he's suing his former attorney and it's just kind of wild man it, this all ties in you know to the to the rick ross uh beef when you get down to it he's trying to he's suing his old attorney that represented him in the lawsuit where um with rick, rick ross's baby's mom where he leaked uh sex tape and you know gave him a, I, I never watched it you know what i'm saying but uh you know i wasn't really that interested in it to see it but um basically you know how fifth likes to do his little voiceover comedy routines and everything like that i guess that's what he did you know um with the sex tape you know what i'm saying y'all know how 50 is man he's petty as hell and him and rose just really really seem to hate each other but you know fifth got real down and dirty when it came to rick ross as you know he had situations with two babies moms he was sued over this baby's mom, Lestonia Leviston, you know, for this situation. And then there was the other um, baby's mama, Rick Ross, Tia Kemp. Wow, well, I'm pretty sure. Get in the comments. Let me know if I'm wrong. You guys, buddy, hung out with her. Um, I believe he took her on like a spending spree. I, I believe he might have been messing with her or whatever. You know, that's what I'm saying, though. Fifth was getting down and dirty, you know, getting to, uh, uh, I guess they're not family. But you know what I'm saying? Like. But friends and family like Fifth will really dig in to try to get that dirt on someone. Like he just wants to ether them, you know, to the point of of no return. Like really put a tarnish and stain on their life. Make them feel real bad. That's what Fifth tries to do. But, um, you know, he ended up being sued, you know, and lost $7 million, um, you know, judgment against him for the lawsuit against Listonia Livingston, the, you know, with the with the sex tape. Well, Fifth turned it around and said, man, you know, and he at the back then he he, uh, you know, filed for bankruptcy to try to avoid having to pay this judgment. Like Fifth's always doing something, you know, uh, trying to finesse a move, trying to make something happen, which I don't blame him. But he also is trying to flip this into a come up because what he what this is all about now is he's suing the law firm Reed and Smith, who represented him. And that, uh, you know, lawsuit against Listonia Livingston, you know, for for leaking the tape. Um, he's suing them for 32 M saying it's malpractice that they did not give him a, you know, a proper defense. You know what I'm saying? They, they didn't they didn't do their job. So he's suing them. And, you know, back in that case against the baby's mom, he, you know, swears up and down that he didn't uh leak the tape that the tape was he found it on a website and that the website was related to rick ross so he's trying to put it on rose but um either way um i believe she still would have had some uh grounds to sue him because you know he did that voiceover you know comedy routine so either way you know what i'm saying i i believe that there's some grounds there for who her to sue 50 cent but getting back to this he's suing you know these attorneys who represented him and what's going on now is he's been trying to subpoena rick ross you know to to have to testify in this lawsuit against his former attorneys and you know he's been unsuccessful to do so and he's trying to get more time you know um as january 31st is is the next court date when they want this done by you know to have ross subpoena to the lawsuit and you know he said he's had to he's had to hire special process servers to to travel across the country and try to sue or i'm sorry and try to um subpoena rick ross give him that paperwork and you know they ain't been able to do it it's it's, it's just a kind of crazy situation and it all just stems back to this beef you know like i said fifth you know kind of dug himself a hole on this one i think like i don't know you guys let me know your opinion but like i said he just he just took it really, really far, you know, uh, digging in, trying to find. So, I mean, he ended up getting that, you know, Officer Ricky info and everything like that. But I don't know. You know, you play these kind of games. 
then people are suing you. I mean, if you ask me, Fifth's really got no one to blame himself. But um, I don't know. We'll see how he'll come out on this one. Like I said, he's trying to, hey, I'm losing seven M's. You know, um, I want to turn this into a $32 million come up, you know, so I'm still ahead in the, in the end, you know, but um, I don't know. You know, I don't think these dudes will ever dead the beef, you know, but then again, we never thought that game and 50 would dead the beef, which they did. But, um, you know, game's been trying to really push that to something else. You know, all these headlines, he's been in the news lately trying to, you know, get fifth to do more music with him or, you know, he just been, he had 50 cents name in his mouth a lot. Yeah, which I thought was kind of corny, but um, we seen we seen Game and Fifth bury the hatchet, but I don't know. I I, I don't even think I think him and Rose's uh, beef goes even you know deeper. You know what I'm saying? Like I don't know, but um, you know they're they're calling this um, you know the the other side is calling this a stall tactic. You know that that Fifty is doing to try to hold things up with this whole um, you know subpoenaing Rick Ross um. I don't know. Like I said, they, they've been unsuccessful. They've tried to serve them with that paperwork like five times. But what I'm thinking is, you know, in the end, if he does subpoena Rick Ross, um, you know, my guess that their, you know, their um, strategy is that they're going to try to, you know, ask Ross about this this website that 50 Cent is alleging that he got the, you know, the tape from that. He's not the one that leaked it, that this website, you know, was related to Rick Ross and Rick Ross put it out to clown her um i don't know you know i'm sure rick ross will deny it but either way i just don't know that any of this helps his case i don't know if this is some kind of you know play to say oh you know we couldn't we couldn't get we couldn't subpoena him um you know i couldn't get a proper defense in this one who knows you know what i'm saying like he's suing these people for malpractice for a lawsuit that he lost um like I said, I don't think he really had any wins in that lawsuit because regardless if the tape came from him or not, bro, you try, you put out a video, you know, with doing a voiceover, clowning around, you know, trying to humiliate this woman. And she went as far to say that, you know, she suffered from depress depression. This is his uh, baby's mom. You know, she went through depression and humiliation and everything to the point where she was on the edge thinking about ending it all if you guys catch what i'm trying to say and you know um all this stuff that these games that 50 cent plays we know he plays dirty we know he's petty as hell um people can sue you man for anything you know we know this um a lawsuit ain't nothing but filling out paperwork putting up the money you know the initial money which you need to do which isn't that much and um you know if someone feels you have a case and you don't really have the bread to put up yourself attorneys will step in you know what i'm saying and represent people because they know it's going to be a bag at the end of the day and 50 cents always playing these games and i don't know i feel like you know now when um it's caught up to him he's trying to go every which way he can to not pay up the money which we've seen other people like the game do but um well, i mean which you know myself i probably would do the same thing maybe you know if, if i if i lost millions of dollars i'm probably going to try to do whatever i can to not pay the money but i mean you know, you can't blame him for that. But I'm just saying, uh, Fifth brought this all on himself. And um, it is what it is. But uh, I just wanted to tap in and bring you guys this video. Because, like I said, this has been going on for so long. 50 Cent and Rick Ross issues. I don't forgot what it even started all over, y'all. I'm going to keep it real. I totally forgot, man. But I don't know, man. This this just all kind of uh, looking corny to me. And, you know, they just need to leave this alone. But um, this is just a uh, hip hop beef that just keeps on going forever. And, you know, I'm like I said, I'm pretty sure these two will be our, each other's arch nemesis and arch rivals, uh, you know, forever. So I don't know. That's all I really got. Tapping in the comments. Let me know your guys thoughts on this. Thank you for tuning in. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. Hit the bell, as I said. And, um, you know, it's all about on my channel for the new viewers. It's all about hearing what you guys, the people got to say. So I look forward to hearing your thoughts and your take in that comment section. It's Jay Coffee Talk signing out. We cover music, sports, news, current events, and much, much more on this channel. I'll catch you guys on the next video. I'm out of here. Peace.